Is the Divine Masculine Twin Flame really coming home? I'm sure that you see a lot of these types of titles on YouTube or wherever. Like, um, is the Divine Masculine, you know, the Divine Masculine is coming home or uh, the Divine Masculine this or the Divine Masculine that. So we're going to go in depth on what this actually means for you. Now, whether you are the feminine wanting the masculine to come home or you are the masculine wanting the feminine to come home, the process is exactly the same. So whichever one of you is watching this video, I'm sure there are concerns as to whether your masculine or feminine perfect partner is in fact coming home or not. And the answer is yes, absolutely. But, 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 it does absolutely depend upon you to clear that pathway. What I mean by that is they certainly can come home and they certainly will come home if you clear away the blocks and upsets you share to coming into union. How do you do that? You use the mirror exercise. You, use, you utilize the mirror ex exercise to heal your blocks and upsets. The things that are keeping you apart and from being in union are your blocks and upsets. Those blocks and upsets are shared. That means that you contain the same exact ones as them. What's yours is theirs, and what's theirs is yours. You are one. So thinking anything other than that, any belief, any thought pattern that is different than that is what separation is. That's what, by believing that you contain something different than them, or that they contain something different than you, is separation consciousness. Now, that separation consciousness needs to be cleared or healed in order to get into union and harmonious union. Every single fragmented piece of you that holds some kind of separated belief that is not in alignment with loving yourself is separation, is separation consciousness. And those things are shared. They are the same in them as they are in you. That means that every one of those fragmented pieces of you has to be healed before being in union becomes your physical reality. Now, the beautiful part of this journey is that you only have to go within and work on yourself. You don't have to do anything outside of yourself to fix them or to heal them. There's no need to stress out about how, like, like how you're going to get them on board here. There's no need to stress out about how you're going to convince them to get into union or harmonious union. You only have to have to focus within yourself. You only have to heal the things that are keeping you separated within yourself. That takes a lot of worry away from this whole journey. You know, it's taking the worry of, takes the worry out of 
what they're doing takes that out of the equation. That's pretty relieving. Like all you are responsible for is focusing on you and healing your upsets and blocks. Right? So this journey isn't as complicated as it's made out to be. Now when you heal your separation consciousness piece by piece, you change your inner reality. And in clearing away the separation consciousness for yourself, you also clear that away for them. So there you go. It takes the worry out of how you are going to change their mind. You're doing it within, within yourself. They stop like wanting to have nothing to do with you. They stop wanting to ignore you. Why? Because you totally change their perspective. How? Because you totally change your perspective. You changed your perspective from within first. Remember, your consciousness is shared. So, yeah, there's an inner journey that to, to take that requires you to work through the challenges within yourself. But there are plenty of resources to help you do that. And the reward for working through all of your upsets and blocks to harmonious union is your twin flame. Is physically being with your one true love. Is living your heaven on earth. Because if you can clear away the blocks to your true love, which is a pretty big deal, then you can clear away the blocks to anything. Doesn't that sound better than what it is you're experiencing now? So you do have to do some work to get it. You do have to do go within yourself and do work. You know, you're not being asked to pick a building up by yourself. You're asking you're being asked to go within and heal yourself. What else is there for you to do? Like, honestly, is there anything more important than filling your life with love? Is there anything in your life that takes a bigger priority than loving yourself? So the quicker you get to work, the quicker you can be in union, the quicker you can be in harmonious union. Sound good? Click the links below. Check out how you can get free guidance sessions. Join my classes or my private guidance sessions. And learn how to heal your upsets and blocks using the mirror exercise. And I'll see you all next time.